All right, all right, all right. Mixed State Show live here at the Bushwick Collective in the NYC. To my right, man, my man Jukes just put me on to this project here like a week ago. I downloaded it on the plane and was blown away by it, man. We got the homie Hayes in the building. Peace, peace. You produced the whole project? Oh, yeah. Except for the intro and the outro. Doc Ock, Dick Doc. The hip, looks dark. the hip hop shop volume one volume one so you so we were talking about the vibe of it man what was the vibe when you put that that put that joint together yo honestly i just did it for the hip hop heads man you know i made it from the sense of going back to you know fat beats and digging in the crates uh -huh, and uh -huh. just crate digging and finding all of these samples that were used uh -huh. some that weren't just exploring albums and it was just like man i want to make something with that feel because I don't feel that a lot. Yeah. And I think that's the whole purpose of music, to yeah. make people feel something. And yeah. I wanted to make something with that feel, so. Nice. Volume so, one. <laughs> so what, what project out there that's kind of close to the template that's, that you put together, that you can kind of relate to, as far as a producer who put that type of project together here well, recently? Well, honestly, like all the projects within the whole back block shit, uh -huh. um, you know, Mike Hands, Zim Recording shit, Innocent. Yeah. That whole, you know, Culture Pushes Collective. That's, it's like we all, like, if you're in New York and you do hip hop, yeah. we all know each other. And once you start venturing out of New York, you start going to every other state. Like, we all start coming together. We all know uh, what we're doing. So, yeah. It's actually a whole hip hop movement out there. I mean, I yeah. hope everybody's just tuning in. Yeah, New, New York is not as big as people think it is when it's, as far as the music not, culture, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we all know each other. Yeah, 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 yeah. So how, how long you been doing it, man? When when you started when you started tinkering and, and tampering and putting stuff together? Oh man, hold on, he about to show my age. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, I've been doing this since '90s, definitely since okay. the '90s. Okay, all right, all right, all right. So original dick. Uh, uh, crate digger. Oh yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah, Dusty Records, going to Fat Beats and all that kind of oh, stuff. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> like if there was any garage shit, like for a moment in my life, I don't do it so much now because we got MP3s and waves and shit. Yeah. But for a time of my life, if there was a record store, uh -huh. if there was any fucking yard sale or anything, I'm there. I'm buying records. Yeah. I'm throwing them in the trunk. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that is that something you still do as far as your your pro your process? No, because I have a lot of records and, yeah, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and then, you know, we got MP3s and WAV files now. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you miss the analog style of uh, putting music Hell down? yeah. <laughs> okay. Hell yeah. I mean, analog is dope and it has its lane, but so does digital. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, there's a lot of stuff that I do that I don't sample anything, but you got to have love for the whole production of it to find in the right horn, the right kick, the right snare uh -huh. to go with something else that it wasn't supposed to. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you got to have the patience. <laughs> but it's, there's no patience when you're doing something that you love. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I, I'm, a, I, I'm a DJ. I, I got to go, 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 go. So it's a little bit different from me on that end. Um, so what we got going on in the future, man? What's some other projects you're working on that you could talk about? All right, so volume two, we're working on that now. Uh-huh. You know, uh, Dreddy Kruger, I've done a lot of production from him, a lot of features. I'm on pretty much everybody on Backblocks Project, mm -hmm. working with Mike Hands. There's a lot of stuff going on right now. Yeah. Chief Freck out there in Canada. Trust me, y'all gonna hear a lot from me this year. There we go, there we go. This is your coming out party, right? Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> <Balls>. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. My bad. His hip hop coming out party. <laughs> so how's it working with the team, man? How, how do you feel working with those guys and vibing with them and everything? Loved it. Like we all knew each other before I was part of Backblock. Mm -hmm. You know, because me and Jux was together on them recording. So mm -hmm. we been had a vibe. And then, you know, I met Ledger and everybody else along the way. And it was like, we always had the vibe. We always gelled yeah. together. We yeah. always did the, yeah. the hip hop shit. So it was like, yeah. 
It, it was. Just, it just made sense. Hell yeah, it was yeah. clandestine. Yeah, 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 yeah. So uh, I'll tell you what, man. So the project is on streaming platforms and everything right Every now. Every streaming platform. Right. Every team. How, how could how could we get the people to buy the project? Where's the best place to go purchase that for you? That benefits you the mess. They all benefit me. All right. Just please buy it. If you fuck with hip hop, fuck with this. Trust Pay for me. It, yeah. Like I shit you not. Like you know how everybody's like, yo, now nah, my shit is dope. Like no, this yeah. shit is dope. It's dope. It's dope. This no. Shit is dope. Yeah, no. <laughs> you, I listen to it personally. I press play and I don't stop. I just keep going, keep going, and I run it back. And it, it, it loops and I forget. I'm like, oh, we started over again. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I appreciate that, bro. Dope, man. Dope. So how would you explain your your production style? Does do you do you have a quote unquote sound or you just you just you just mess with things until it works? Honestly, I don't know anyone else who has my particular sound. Like, mine's just my own and it, I I guess it just comes from my musical background. Mm-hmm. I just make shit that, like I said, that makes me feel something, uh-huh. and that's how I know I got it right. Yeah, yeah. Who, who's who's the producer that you study the most? That you think? There's no one producer that you can study. You got to study the whole thing overall. Uh-huh. Like, you know, Jay Dilla got his style, mm-hmm. and then you got Primo with his style. Yeah. You got Kanye with his style. Uh-huh. And then you got like Dr. Dre with his style. Rockweiler, like, there's so many. Rockweiler. <laughs> you know what I mean? And funny thing is, he grew. Up, I grew up two blocks away from Rockwell. Okay. So it was just like going to his crib was dope. Yeah. You know what I mean? And he's criminally underrated. Criminally underrated. Oh yeah. Yeah. Shout out to Rock. Yeah, man, yeah, <laughs> dope, 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 man. So I tell you what, brother. Um, whoever rocks on the mixtape show, I call him alumni. You know what I'm saying? So I'm officially inducting you to the alumni hey, mixtape show hall of fame you know what I'm, I'm saying? loving it i appreciate it <laughs> and um we definitely gonna put, i'm gonna upload the, the music on the radio station and everything like that like awesome. i literally just got it before coming out here so i'm gonna definitely upload those joints uh-huh. and um when new joints come out man we're gonna connect and let's talk about those too oh hell yeah man this is gonna be a lot more coming trust definitely, me definitely social media what's the best way we can follow your journey man hayes and I'm cool on everything hayes and i'm cool on instagram facebook hayes and i'm cool on tiktok hayes and Everywhere, it's just Hazenomical. Yeah. If you can spell it, you can find me. There we go. There we go. <laughs> the homie Hazenomical. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the homie Jux Diamonds for putting oh, yeah. me on the game. Definitely. You know what I'm saying? Now I feel like I'm connected. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, you you're, you're in the inner sanctum. Yeah, 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 yeah. Part of the team, man. So enjoy the rest of your day, brother. Appreciate that that project you put out for hip hop, man. Of course. And uh, we're gonna definitely be blasting that joint. All right. Uh, definitely. More all to right. come. There we go. We'll, we'll be right back. <laughs>